Hey guys, it's Lyra here. So today marks the day that I am going to be starting a series called Determining Your Destiny. So for each video that I upload in this series, I am going to be focusing on one aspect or factor that will contribute to you achieving your goals to success and to ultimately a happy life. These factors don't just contribute to your success. I believe that they are necessary in order for you to be successful or to achieve your goals. They are necessary, they are crucial. I'm really excited about this series actually. Okay, so I want to tell you all about a book that I read that changed my life. It forever changed the direction of my life and ultimately how I viewed life because of this one book. And this book is called Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, okay? <laughs> now this is not um, a diss on JK Rowling. But it isn't necessarily the book that changed my life, it's the fact that I started to read. I picked up this book when I was 12 years old, and before that I had absolutely zero interest in reading or learning, really. That book got me hooked on reading, and ever since then I've been an avid reader, and I transitioned from fiction to non-fiction, and once I did that, my world expanded even more and this one entry point which for me was reading taught me the value of learning taught me the value of accumulating knowledge once you enter into that world you never go back you're never the same person it's a fundamental shift in your mindset and your personality and who you are as a person knowledge is so powerful you've all heard that quote knowledge is power well, the reason why you hear that quote so much is because it's true. Without knowledge, without understanding something, you cannot bridge the gap between what you want in your mind and making it a reality, between your desires and seeing them come to life. Knowledge is the bridge to that gap. It's so crucial. Now, knowledge and wisdom are different. Wisdom is achieved through learning from experience, I believe through living it, whereas knowledge is all in your head, it's intellectual. But we don't live enough to experience everything. So that's where knowledge comes in. That's what books are for and other mediums of communication. It's so that people can take what they learn through experience in their lives and transcribe it into something that they can share with people. It's so amazing because sometimes people spend their entire lives, their entire lives, accumulating some form of knowledge so that they can pass it on to you. And you don't have to experience or live it in order to gain value from it. And it is so amazing. Knowledge is a gift. It truly is a gift that we should all be so grateful for, that we have access to so much wisdom and so much knowledge. And I really believe that you all should be taking advantage of it. Think about whatever you want or whatever you think will make you happy. Knowledge is the key to that. You need it and it's right at your fingertips. It's accessible to you. I mean, how crazy is that, right? If you don't like reading, listen to audiobooks. There's so many books nowadays that are transcribed into audio and you can just go for a walk and listen to uh, a motivational audiobook or an enlightening audiobook. Learning will empower you because it will shed light on the unknown and the unknown will no longer evoke fear. Once you have mastered learning, you will feel that you can master anything because that is precisely how you master anything by learning. So get this key skill mastered, master learning, and then you have the power to master whatever you want. So if you haven't already started actively learning, I urge you to make it a priority in life. Don't just say, oh yeah, that's a nice idea. Do it, take 
action and make it a priority in your life. Make time to learn. Set aside time every single day to learn something new and it will change you for the better. You will realize how powerful you've become just from taking some time every day to learn something. Now I want to tell you all a story. I kind of started getting into um, online marketing and I realized that people were selling all kinds of content online, not necessarily a physical product, but just content, just people talking like me on this video here, but they provide like video courses or something like that. Well, I thought, oh, well, you can sell that, really? And I thought, well, that would be nice if I could sell that, you know? The problem was, I didn't know how. And it seemed like such a daunting, challenging thing, and it seemed like I just didn't have the resources to actually go about selling, selling like a video or something like that online. Like, how do you actually do that, right? All I did was, I researched it for like a week straight of just non-stop like five hour blocks of researching how you could actually set up like a website, set up a, a payment processor and market it and actually be able to deliver the product online and all of this information was free and accessible now. Granted, it wasn't very easy to find. There were steps in between that I had to figure out and troubleshoot and problem solve. But you know what? The point is that I figured it out for free. I didn't have to pay anybody to figure it out. I just had Google and YouTube. That's all I used. I figured out how to do this and it was such an amazing, empowering experience because I originally thought that I didn't have the intelligence or the resources to accomplish. I accomplished. Start somewhere, okay? And that is my first video for this series, Determining Your Destiny. I hope that you all found it useful, and until next video, have a fantastic week, guys. Bye.